Well, I'll hand it there, Pluckers. I'll have a sore finger again with you. Thanks indeed for joining me for another guitar lesson. Uh, this one is in response to a request I've had for a lesson on a classic song from uh, Glen Campbell called Galveston. Lovely song, nice chords. Okay, you're going to enjoy this, I'm sure. I'm in standard tuning, uh, but I do have a capo on the second fret, and that's purely to uh, suit my own voice range at the moment. Okay, feel free to move the capo about to suit your own voice, or even do away with it altogether. Okay, just use the same chord sequence uh, that I'm about to show you. Okay, so um, without more ado, I'm going to go through the song now, the whole thing, hopefully without making too many boo boos. Um, and then I'll break it down and show you how I played it and um, you will probably have realised my voice is somewhat croaky at the moment I am under the influence of a cold <laughs> so um, but the show must go on okay it might even improve my voice I don't know that sometimes does work that way so anyway let's get to it and <clears throat> so here we go <laughs> Galveston, oh Galveston, I still hear your sea winds blowing. I still see her dark eyes glowing. She's 21 when I left Galveston. Galveston, oh Galveston. I still hear your sea waves crashing While I watch the cannons flashing I clean my gun and dream of Galveston I still hear you standing There you go, something like that, a bit loose around the edges, but not too bad. Okay, right, um, firstly, right, let's get to the introduction, right, this is just something, um, uh, I'm not sure what's actually played on the original record, but uh, I heard this somewhere and I thought that's quite nice, and it's basically a um, D chord, and I'm plucking down from 4 down to um, 1 and then taking the uh, second finger off the first string and open, so you've got an open first string and I'm taking the other finger off as well so you're just left with the third on the second string so you've got and then you basically go back up to the fourth string 1, 2, 3, 4 ok so it's down, take those two fingers off and go back up, one, two, three, four, okay, and then the second bit is basically another D, and this time you put your pinky on the third fret of the first string, off, second string, third string, okay, so the whole thing is You just repeat that first line again, then it go down the D again, and then G, A, D, and then the song starts. Galveston, oh Galveston. Okay, so let's do that again in slow motion.
Galveston, right, so it goes into the chord, this, the verse, goes into D, okay, Galveston, O, and then G to A to D again, Galveston, okay, so it's Galveston, oh, Galveston, then we go to a D major 7th, nice easy chord, just bar the first three strings on the 2nd fret from the capo, from 5 down to 1, <clears throat> I still hear your D 7th, C wins, G, blow in. Now we have a rundown from G minor, G to E minor, and you just go, just lower that bass note on the sixth string to the second fret, keeping pinky where it is, okay? And then to an E minor. Okay, so it's bum, bum, bum. Okay, so from the beginning, Galveston, oh Galveston. D major 7, I still hear D7 to the G, run down to E minor, A major, I still D, C her, D major 7th, dark eyes, G, run down again to E minor, to A, she was 20, B minor, 1, when and then we do this G chord with an A in the bass, fifth string open, and we play like a, a, an F shape on the third fret from the capo. Um, you can leave the first string open if you so wish. And you basically strum the whole from five down to, you can go to one if you want, but the main strings are five down to two. That's what you want to hear. If you hit the first string, it doesn't matter, it's open. Okay, or you can leave it covered if you so wish. I prefer it. I just I just try to hit five down to two because that's what you hear on the record. I think okay. But if you hit if you've got it covered on the third fret, it doesn't matter. Or if you've got it open, it doesn't matter. Okay. But those are the important ones. Five down to two. Okay. So let's go from the beginning uh, again. So from the beginning of the verse. Galveston, O G A D D major seventh. D7, G, run down to E minor, A major, D, D major 7, G, run down to E minor, A, B minor, A, G with A in the bass, Galveston, and then we go to um, D, uh, so Galveston, sorry, no, we stay there, sorry, don't forget what I just said, stay there, Galveston, and then we do three sort of dum, dum, dum on that G with A in the bass, and then D, single strung them on D, and then the quick G, A, D again, okay? So it comes out of that where, uh, so we just go through the whole thing to the end, that's the end of the first verse, so we just go through the whole thing in one go, it's relatively a bit slower than usual, okay? So, Galveston, oh Galveston, major 7th, the D7, the G, to E minor, A major, the D, to D major 7th, G, run down to E minor, B minor, oh, A, sorry, B minor, then there's G with A in the bass, with Galveston, dum, 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 D, G, A, D, into the second verse. So what we'll do now is we'll go through the intro, we'll go all the way through the intro, all the way to the end of the second verse. The, first, the second verse is exactly the same to play as the first verse, okay? So here we go, from the intro, from the very intro, okay? Galveston, oh Galveston I still hear your sea winds blowing I still see her dark eyes glowing She was 21 when I left Galveston Oops, that was a bit of a naughty, wasn't it? Galveston <laughs>
this time, after the second verse, it doesn't go to the D, after the G to A, it goes to F. I still see her standing by the water. Okay, so it's F. I still see her standing G by the back to F water. G A minor. Standing there looking G out to F C. Okay. That's the first two lines of the middle section. Let's go through that again. So after it comes out, the second verse. Bum, bum, F. I still see her standing G, da, da, F. G, A minor. Standing by, looking G, out to F. And is she D minor? She waiting to G. There for C major seventh. B. Okay, so that's C without the first finger. O open second string. Okay. Okay, so that's uh, let's go through that whole thing again from end of the second verse. I still see uh, F to G to F to G to A minor. Da 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 to the G to F to D minor to G to C major seventh A minor seventh on the beach where we used to so A minor seventh A minor with a third string open and then we go to on the beach where we used to D minor seventh okay so that's barring the first two strings on the first fret and second finger going on the second fret of the third string and you've strummed from five down to one. Okay, so that's, um, let's go through that again. So F, I still see a standing G by the old F to G, A minor. There she's da, 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 a G to F, and the D minor to G to C major seven on that. A minor seventh beat where we used to D minor seventh run G A Galveston back into the another verse okay the last verse okay so, okay so let's go through that whole coming out the second verse into the middle section and into the last verse which is uh, similar but slightly different to the normal verse okay so here we go from the end of the second verse where it goes um, Galveston I still see a standing by the water looking out to see is she waiting same up to that point up to the A before I B minor that's the same watch now this is where it changes a bit so your first chord is when you get to the B minor watch your open take the bar lift the bar slightly so you can on this top section so you've got an open fifth string because you need to play that so it's like a progression okay so it's like for I watch your sea birds so it's watch your sea birds okay G what flying in then E so that's and that's a G and then like you did on the progression in the verse down to F sharp in the bass second fret sixth string putting in the E minor sun then this uh, G with A in the bass at Galvest All right so let's get to that point so from the Beginning of the third verse, the end, the last verse, okay? Galveston, oh Galveston, I am so afraid of dying. I try my tears to see 
she's crying. Here we go. I watch your seabirds flying in the sun. That girl first. And then we go to a B chord, unfortunately. Second fret from the capo. Bar chord, bar on the second fret from the capo. And then either using your three fingers like that uh, on the uh, from the capo, it's the 4th fret from the capo, uh, the 4th, 3rd and 2nd strings, or you can use the single finger, most people do, or some people use their little finger, but uh, I use, tend to use my 3rd finger. And it's basically, it's basically a, a peggioed, so you're working your way down from the 5th string, down to the 2nd string, and then adding a suspended note, fret from the capo on the second string and then back up third string fourth string so okay so it's down from five uh, fifth string down to the second string adding pinky then taking it off and going three four okay so let's get that far so uh, from the end of the uh, this goes from the beginning of the last verse again. Galveston, oh Galveston, I am so afraid of dying. I dry the tears that she is crying. I watch your seabirds flying in the sun. And then that back to that G chord with the A in the bass. Add Galva. And then we go to the intros. No, just play the intro again, okay? So Add Galva Stone. So um, let's just go through that once again. The last verse is the most complicated bit. Okay, so Galveston, oh G A Galveston, G, uh, D major seventh. I was so afraid. D seventh of G. And run down to E minor to A major for I D. Try the D major seventh. Today so G. Run down to E minor again to A. For I B minor, then B minor with A open, fifth string open, G, then drop a note on the on the sixth string, and then E minor again, and then a single strum on the uh, D, a G with the A in the bass, gal verse, then this B B chord with this uh, arpeggiated, and then back to a single strum on this uh, G with A in the bass again, and then into the intro. Okay, right, so let's go through the whole thing. <laughs> let's take it ball by the horns and go through the whole thing. Okay, so here we go. <clears throat> Still see her stand. 
I'll see you in the next uh, video. Thanks very much indeed. Bye for now.